Katie Holmes dumped Jamie Foxx because he couldn't make a commitment. Katie Holmes didn't dump Jamie Foxx because he couldn't make a commitment, despite a new report. Gossip Cop can exclusively correct this made-up story. Virtually everything in the article about why they're over is untrue. After referencing the photos of Fox and Holmes walking on a Malibu beach together, okay. Writes, what started out as a harmless photo opportunity blew up into a huge fight between Katie and Jamie, one that ultimately resulted in a couple calling it quits. Next, a totally misinformed or simply fictitious insider suggests that Holmes was behind the paparazzi pictures. The off-base source tells the untrustworthy tabloid Katie was so determined for them to come out of hiding. She'd been really piling on the pressure, so he went along with it, but afterward he had to admit the whole thing bugged him. The magazine's alleged insider says once the photos on the beach emerged, Jamie questioned why they needed to parade around in front of the world like that, which prompted Holmes to supposedly ask whether he saw them getting married down the line, and he didn't answer her. The often inaccurate tabloid maintains that after Holmes allowed Fox to become so intertwined in her and 11-year-old daughter Shuri's life, she thought they were surely headed that way. She'd assumed that going public was the first big step in getting Jamie to ultimately make a commitment. She hoped he would propose or at least invite her to move in with him permanently, continues the seemingly fabricated insider. But when that didn't happen, asserts the publication, Holmes allegedly felt she needed to draw a line in the sand. The highly suspect insider concludes, Katie is too strong to be messed with like that, so she ended it. She can't believe how terribly he's let her down. And while the magazine's account is all very dramatic, it is not remotely accurate. As Gossip Cop has repeatedly mentioned, the pictures of Holmes and Fox were not a photo opportunity. On the contrary, they were invasive paparazzi pictures taken with long lenses, unbeknownst to the two stars. That's why the magazine's claims about the actress being so determined for them to come out of hiding and Fox having went along with it are nothing more than lies. Consequently, the contention of the so-called insider about how Jamie questioned why they needed to parade around in front of the world like that is absurd. Neither he nor Holmes had sought to have their casual relationship exposed like that. Additionally, the assertions that Fox's life is intertwined with Holmes' daughter Shuri, who he's never met, and that the actress believed going public would lead him to propose to her are farcical. It appears the only reason the tabloid came to the conclusion that Holmes ended it with Fox is simply because they have not been spotted together since the photos of them on the beach in Malibu. Gossip Cop looked into the story and almost none of it is remotely accurate. Neither Fox nor Holmes had sought the publication of the paparazzi pictures nor were they even aware they were being taken at the time. Also, the relationship has never been anything more than casual, so the contention that Holmes was looking for the lifelong bachelor to pop the question is ridiculous. Sources close to both Holmes and Fox have assured Gossip Cop the entire article is a fabrication. Of course, few should be surprised, given how many times OK has splashed complete lies about them on the cover of its magazine. While Gossip Cop could have said numerous times the tabloid has been dead wrong about Holmes and Fox, we'll limit our proof to just a couple of examples. For instance, nearly two years ago in January 2016, we exposed the publication when it falsely exclaimed, Wedding and a baby for Fox and Holmes. In that piece of fiction, the outlet maintained they were getting married, starting a family, together, and that Holmes' ex-husband Tom Cruise even gave her his blessing. That preposterously fabricated report was quickly followed up by another equally untrue cover story in March 2016 about a pregnant Holmes having a baby girl with Fox. Once again, Gossip Cop busted the tabloid for asserting they found out the actress was expecting on Valentine's Day and that Cruz sent his ex-wife a $2,500 bouquet of flowers to congratulate her. 
Those were all lies, as is the current tale about Holmes dumping Fox because he couldn't make a commitment.